Are you ready to have your kitchen sounding like a chiropractor's office with a whole lot of cracking and moaning? Yes, I'm about to show you how to make the most best, the most juiciest seafood boil that you have ever had in your life. I'm trying to tell you, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Rock that notification bell so you do not miss out on the latest video. Leave your boy a like as well as a comment. Let me know what you think. And you know what it is. Let's get started. So these are the ingredients that we will be using today. I have some corn, some smoked sausage, some potatoes, some Dungeness crab. Yes, Dungeness is my favorite next to king crab, as well as about a half a pound of peeled in deveined shrimp. So I'm going to go ahead and get some water to a boil. I had added a little bit of salt to that thing. And I'm just going to toss the potatoes as well as the corn in there and let them do their thing. And guys, let me know down in the comments, what is your favorite crab? Is it king crab? Dungeness? Is it snow? Is it blue? With me, it's kind of king as well as Dungeness. Those are my two favorites, guys. So you want to cook your potatoes and your corn until they're nice and done, just like so take them out of the water, put them to the side, get a brand new pot of water going, season that thing up with some Old Bay, eyeball that thing, and then go ahead and toss your Dungeness crab or whatever crab you're using in that water and let it do its thing as we move on to the next step. So you want to go ahead and grab a nice size pan, drizzle a little bit of olive oil in there, and I'm going to throw in a little bit of minced garlic as well as a whole onion and kind of let them talk to each other. And then I'm going to add in that smoked sausage, let that join the party, get that all mixed up and sizzling, smelling all good and stuff. At this point, your kitchen is smelling oh so good. So much aroma in the air, guys, because you got everything going right now. You got that crab in the background going. You got this going. Smells so good, guys. I cannot wait to dig in. Once we have a nice little sear on all these ingredients, we're going to toss in two sticks of unsalted butter. Once that's in there, we're going to eyeball these ingredients, a little bit of Old Bay. And guys, you want to kind of taste as you go, add a little more here and there, depending on how much seasoning you want in your seafood boil. I go generous. I'm going to go ahead and add a little bit of lemon pepper as well, some Italian seasoning, as well as a little bit of hot sauce in that thing and get all that mixed up and talking to each other. And like I said, I love to go generous. Because you know how it goes, man. You got to season up everything right, everything correct. We ain't got bland anything over here. You know what I'm talking about? Not even a seafood boil. Everything seasoned up correctly, guys. So we're going to get all those ingredients in there. Get that all mixed up. Talking to each other. Sizzling. Man, I'm trying to tell you, you are going to love this seafood boil. If you don't eat seafood, I don't know what's wrong with you. If you're allergic, I feel bad for you. So we're going to go ahead and toss in that shrimp into the party get that in there get that sizzling get that going i'm gonna give it a nice little mix then top it off let it kind of bubble up and you know cook for the next couple minutes until it's nice and fully cooked looking oh so delicious all right at this point our shrimp is just about fully cooked man this looks so so good guys believe me tastes as good as it looks so i'm gonna grab that bowl of potatoes and corn and i'm gonna reincorporate all those ingredients into the party guys join join the fun i'm gonna get them in there give them a nice little toss get them all well incorporated guys get all those flavors talking to each other
everything is uh just about fully cooked so it's time to move on to my favorite part which is plating up guys we're gonna grab that big old pot full of goodness drop it into your favorite pan just like so once you have that in there go ahead and grab your crab whatever crab you chose if whether it be dungeness snow king whatever it was toss that on there as well grab a little bit of dry parsley sprinkle that on the top crack that crab just like so and enjoy guys man i'm trying to tell you when i told you kitchen sounded like a chiropractor's office i was not lying to you you're gonna hear a whole lot of crap get cracked you're gonna hear a whole lot of moaning and groaning from the flavors in the seafood boil guys because <laughs> it's so good i'll try to tell you guys it's so delicious guys i don't know man it's just something about a seafood boil sitting down with the family you know getting messy i usually have some gloves and whatnot sitting back with everybody and just enjoying this delicacy because that's what it is guys this is a delicacy you know how expensive crab gets but it's so so delicious and i just love it every time we sit down and eat it it's a special moment i hope you guys enjoy it as well guys look at the screen look at this goodness guys make this recipe enjoy it with your boy there's like a million and one ways to make a seafood boil but hands down this is my absolute favorite method of getting it done um i also sometimes make it in one of those like oven bags as well i might do a separate video on that method but those are kind of my top two ways of making it i think this is the best most flavorful way to make it in my most humblest opinion guys but yeah this was so easy to make guys it was a lot of fun eating it as well as making it hope you guys enjoyed the video uh last but not least i do want to give a special shout out to all of our channel members on the screen i have a list of all of my guys and girls supporting your boy i really appreciate the love especially our newest member tracy love all you guys um i hope you guys enjoyed the video like i said and i will see you on the next one doses